Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Um, thank you very much for this uh, wonderful um, chance to have you here. We are going to um, ask you um, about the situation in Gaza. So let's start. Uh, can you can you give me your full name and what you are doing now in Gaza? Yes. First, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Alhamdulillah, wa salatu wa salamu ala Rasulullah. First, I want to thank, uh, thank you, uh, Dad, and thanks for all my dear sister and brothers who helped me uh, to come here and to be with you. Uh, to introduce myself, and my name is uh, Tahrir al -Ghamri. I'm a student from Islamic University of Gaza, uh, English department. Uh, now uh, I want to tell you about the situation and the problems we are suffering in, in Gaza Strip during the siege period. Actually, uh, the big problem we are suffering now, uh, um, we can uh, say it in, uh, or summarize it in one word. Uh, Gaza uh, don't have enough fuel. This words or this sentence can be divided into many points. First, no transportation, no enough transportation for the people, for the students who want to go to their university, to their schools, to the workers uh, who want to go to their jobs. So uh, the first point, no transportation, because no, uh, you can't find any fuel inside Gaza. And next, uh, no electricity. Uh, during uh, my life on my house in Khan Yunus city, actually the electricity cut down every day uh, more than six to seven hours. Uh, actually, this is big problems because uh, as me, I'm a student, I can't uh, study or do anything without electricity. And this is a continuously problem during Gaza Strip or inside Gaza Strip. Every day you can't find electricity. Even the electricity it's found, it's cut uh, every minute or every half or an hour. It will cut uh, for many minutes. So it's uh, not continuously. Uh, also, our patients in the hospital, uh, uh, the electricity cut down also in the hospital, so it will be very dangerous for the people, especially who are uh, who are staying in uh, uh, ICU. Yes, mm -hmm. uh, it will be uh, die any time because uh, no electricity uh, to uh, to their uh, medical. medical important tools which are uh, give them a, a chance to alive and fight uh, actually uh, we have also another uh, last uh, problem or last uh, story that's happened uh, because of this big problem no electricity uh, there's the parents uh, they uh, get their ch three children after 15 years of marriage and uh, suddenly uh, they pass away together. Why? Because no electricity. Uh, the father uh, switched on a small candle and put it in the table. And uh, in, in the night, they forget, to, uh, they forget it. So it burned everything in the room and the three children pass away. So we are suffering uh, every day, every moment, every, every hour inside Gaza Strip because of this problem no fuel, no electricity, also no enough medicine for our patients. Uh, for so actually, I don't know what I can see else, but the situation in Gaza is so hard and so difficult these days. Okay, let me just ask you, uh, look at uh, the background first. Um, yes. This uh, blockade by Israel on Gaza, when did it happen? What year was that? The blockade. What yes. year they started to block Gaza? Yes. Nine, uh, 2006? 2006, yes. 2006, yes. All right. Before, after Hamas won an election. Uh, after Hamas won the election, yes. right. So they started the blockade. So before the blockade, how was Gaza? Was it um, much better? Are there people working? They can get supplies? 
Can yes. you describe what was the situation before the blockade? Yes. Uh, also, the situation before the blockade, it, um, actually, it's not uh, much better, but uh, mm. uh, it's much better than now. Okay. Yes. Uh, because uh, before the blockade, uh, the border, uh, the borders were opening, uh, not like now or these days, but uh, these days uh, after Hamas won the election in 2006, the blockade started on Gaza Strip, so uh, no supplies, uh, no uh, open borders, uh, mm. no anything you can find it in Gaza. Uh, also. Uh, the big or big problems. Uh, Israel attacks Gaza every day, every night, uh, every moment. So uh, during or during this period of siege, uh, no good uh, medicine, no good supplies to help people who mm -hmm. are suffering from mm -hmm. these attacks every day. That is after the blockade. Yes. Okay. Let me ask you now. After the blockade and there's these attacks, like every day you're saying bombings, yes. airstrikes. Let us recall what happened during that 2008, on the 27th of December, yes. the, the, uh, the assault or the attack, the fierce attack by the Israeli Defense Force. Yes. Where were you that time, that 27th December? Were you at home? Yes. What happened? Did you get the news how this attack came? Can you describe? Yes. Uh, and the 27th of December 2008, uh, actually I, uh, I was preparing myself for a final exam for the first semester you were in the university. Home. You were at home at yes, that Yes, so I was in my home, mm -hmm. but my friends uh, were in the university. Okay. So maybe I'm s uh, much lucky or more lucky than them because I was in my home, not university. Mm -hmm. Uh, in uh, the first hour of uh, these days, uh, the attacks uh, began at uh, 11 a.m. when uh, all the people in their works and their jobs, the students in their university, their schools, suddenly more than 60 uh, airplane or air cars uh, attacks Gaza in the same time. So it, Gaza Strip is a small area in Palestine. So can you imagine how more than 60 planes mm -hmm. destroying in Gaza Strip during two minutes, not, mm -hmm. not long. So they destroy all the police station, uh, also they destroy and bombing a college, training college mm -hmm. inside Gaza Strip. Uh, also they bombing our, my university, Islamic University of Gaza. Uh, so after this period, uh, Israel continuously uh, destroy and attacks Gaza for one week from the air because they don't have the enough courage to enter Gaza and fight our Mujahideen. So they destroyed Gaza during the air, uh, um, by air during one week. Uh, after that week, the war began and continuously until uh, the 15th of January. Uh, which uh, uh, had result more than uh, 1,000 shaheed and a lot of injured uh, shaheed from children, old men and women, mm -hmm. women also. They destroy everything inside Gaza. Okay, I mean that's that's something that is unimaginable now. You have described the situation now. There's no fuel, electricity is no been cut. No there's enough medicine also. Since 2000. <laughs> Seven, nothing has improved. Yes. Situation bad. Although there is some, some things uh, happening now. There are things that you can get into Gaza, but still things are very bad. Yes. Well, what do you uh, hope um, the people around the world or inter international community? Yes. What do Gaza people hope from the? Uh, international community, the, the Muslims, yes. what are the things that you, you would like people to assist Gaza in what way? Yes, uh, actually first I want to ask them, uh, as you know, in Al-Yawm uh, Al-Akhir, Yawm al qiyamah Allah will ask every Muslim about what do you uh, do for Palestine, for your brother and sister who are suffering from dying inside Gaza Strip. 
what do you do to help them? So I, I hope all of you from now to prepare your uh, answer or his answer to answer Allah uh, when he will ask him about uh, his brother and sister inside Gaza or inside all Palestine and another countries they are need uh, much support. Uh, actually also people can, uh, our people inside Gaza Strip hope that uh, all uh, his brother and sister during or inside the whole world can support us, uh, demand us, uh, not uh, only by money, by things, no, also, but the first thing and the important thing we need it, we need your dua, your, uh, your words which give us more strong, make us more strong when we feel that our brother and sister uh, help us and uh, dua for us, uh, we will be more courage more satisfi satisfaction, more, more comfortable, mm. yes, it will help us. Uh, also, uh, the important points, uh, as uh, all of you know, there are many communication and many organizations inside uh, or during the world. They are working to help our brother and sister inside Palestine. Uh, uh, and a big example, which I know them uh, well, our brother and sister in Mabim organization, they are working every day, every night to help us uh, as much possible as they can. So uh, my suggestion or my opinion, the people can help us by, uh, um, by support these organizations, uh, give, the, uh, give demand to them, give support to them uh, with, uh, which they are will send it to Gaza. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. Uh, I also or in the in the end, I want to ask. Uh, I or, sorry. I want to thanks all these organization w which are helping us during, uh, inside Gaza Strip, especially my organization which I volunteer with them, Mabim organization, uh, which have many projects inside Gaza Strip. Uh, for example, they are want to build a big hospital for children and women. Uh, actually, it's very important. The project uh, Gaza need it these days because we don't have enough hospital. We don't have enough medical uh, medical centers. So uh, this will be a big pro a big project, inshallah. Also, I know uh, Mabim uh, uh, built uh, many mosques inside Gaza Strip which Israel actually destroyed many mosques during the last war. So we need to rebuild these mosques mm -hmm. because this is a symbol for our Islam, for our Aqidah. It's very important in our society mm -hmm. to continue our jihad, our muqawma. Uh, so uh, inshallah, I hope all our sisters and brothers who are uh, hearing me now uh, to help us and support us uh, actually, not all of you can come and support us inside Gaza or inside Palestine, but you can support us during this organization around the world. Thank you very much, Tahrir. Uh, that was uh, very, um, very enriching, and we hope that uh, we will continue this, this um, struggle. And inshallah, we will try to see that brother and sister will will fulfill their responsibility as, as Muslims. Inshallah. Gaza, inshallah. Because Allah will ask everyone of exactly. us. Exactly. Inshallah. Yes. Thank what? you so much. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.